My world met its end a long time ago. The humanity as I knew it, uh, the humanity as I knew it has ceased to exist, and disappeared without a single trace. The gods they believed in had, have died, and churches would were built in as their graves. The chaos turned into order, and it finally became quiet. All I can do is dream, for I am so tired. Before I abandon the words from, from, before I abandon the words that form noise in my head, will you be so kind as to join me in dream seeing? Hello, Charlotte. Episode one: Junk food, gods and teddy bears. Hello, Charlotte. It's nice to meet you. Please take care of me. This is my room. It's rather minimalistic. What a luster design. Um, I mean, it works. It's rather minimalistic. Quite modern, don't you think? Let's go to the dining room. I'm hungry. Yeah, I'm hungry too. Current user has restricted access to teleport Omnicube. It's a data on the cube. Screens. The screen store data user activity. Absolute rule screen must not be turned off. Current user Charlotte is expected to follow the absolute rules implicitly. We're not responsible for body, bodily injury, including dismemberment, metal disturbances, or other harm to the user's well-being caused by infringement of the rules listed above. Omnicubes. Omnicubes, short for omnipotent cubes, are multitask devices that allow the transportation duplication, transportation duplication, creation or disintegration of organic matter and the storage of data. Please do not put liquid soap inside omnicubes, as it might cause unforeseen consequences to happen. Tenants. Please choose a category to read the user's observation that's about Charlotte. I haven't met these three yet, but... Current user who is yet to complete the educational program. Aiden. Ground floor is butler. User, user note. Hobbies include suing and taxidermy. Which is a category... Huxley, a surgeon who owns an interdimensional clinic on the second floor. User note, once ordered 30 boxes of duct tape for unknown purposes. Bennett, that is an Among Us, oh my god. Occupation and real name unknown. User note, uh, Bennett is the name uh, of the badge on his hazmat suit. User, user log might be helpful. 0001. Look out for the puppeteer symbol. Only the users with X in their names have access to all doors. So Charlotte is not one of them. I don't want to sleep yet. Band-aids, scalpels, notes, tea bags. Everything is such a mess. Corridor. Dining room, hold on. TV room. But I can just walk through the sofa? Okay, sure. Watch TV. All 99 channels show commercials 24-7. Next on Panopticon TV. Uh, synth the meal commercial. Don't miss it. Switch the channel? Yes. You and only you can stop the world crisis. Help stop overproduction by buying things now. Organic junk food at Charlie's is the ultimate cure for obesity. Order now by calling 00, uh, wait, 0800XXXXXX. That's enough TV for today. What is the point of having a TV if only commercials are there? It wasn't locked yesterday. 
That's an important place, I can tell. I don't need to call anyone right now. Access denied, it'll fuck you too. Swimming for everyone. Dressmaking made easy. Fancy folds. Art of napkin folding. Aiden's bookshelf. I find it cute. Uh, anarchist cookbook. Uh, with now more recipes. Kaboom. Advanced chemistry for explosives, enthu explosives enthusiasts. Science fiction Almac 24th edition. These are Bennett's shelves. They just scream danger and geek. The shelves are full of literature and alien language. I can't read the titles. The Nerd Lord. The Fair Salary Man. Astronaut Commando. This is Mother Shelf. She loves romance books. Note obtained. Okay. What does it say? The Golden Apples of the Sun. Physics of the Impossible. One Hit Man. <laughs> one Hit Man. Because is that supposed to be a One Punch Man reference? My Humble Bookshelf. Physics of the Impossible. The Apples of the Sun. The Golden Apples of the Sun. Are these supposed to be like references to other things? Stuff. Book of Truth. This book contains all the world's secret. Huh? What's the note say? The magic word is please. So it says the magic word is please. The book of truth. Um, I guess. I guess we will never know what it says. Um, all right, dining. Uh, wait. This is the bedroom. Okay. Soap obtained. Not even our dining room drawers have anything edible. <laughs> oh no. It's just like me, for real, for real. The last time I tried to cook something, the world was almost destroyed by the food monster. I wish Bennett didn't put his chemicals on the shelves along with the sugar and the salt. Puppet manual, 0000. The puppet control menu has four options. Stop, at, uh, tasks, rewind points, exit. Junk is stuff we throw away. Stuff is junk we keep. Tasks are daily life quests. Rewind points contain save data of previous events. MB should be only uh, should be used only if the puppet dies or if the puppet must leave the control ha control console. Exit should not be an option for a responsible puppeteer. User log the house. 0002. Basement. Uh, dissection room. Tailoring room. Test rooms. Ground floor. Living rooms. Some tableware inside. Some tableware inside. What's this? Dear Charlotte, I'll be home late. Call 0800 to order food from Charlie's uh, XOXO mom. This note is eight months old. My parents work on holidays. New task received. Order food. I remember seeing that there was a phone here. Hey, it's Charlick Organic Foods. Please place your order. Um, I'd like to order eco-friendly chicken nuggets and instant diabetes soda, please. I shouldn't be so nervous when talking to a machine. Thank you for the uh, for ordering at Charlie's. Stay healthiest with us. I mean, it doesn't seem like it. Like that'll be the case. Oh, wow, that was quick. Wait. Where is it? Actually, in put magic word. Uh, it was... What a nice girl. Access granted. Hallway. A strange hissing noise is coming from behind the door. Want me to open it? Yes. Charlotte opens the door. 
There's a giant cockroach behind it. Charlie's healthy junk foods. Uh, wait, Charlie's healthy junk foods delivery. Please sign here. Okie dokie. Gotta make my signature beautiful. Charlie draw draws a large X on the paper. Nailed it. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed the rest of your day. The delivery man hisses politely and leaves. Obtained a lucky meal. Mutas received a feed Charlotte. I'd like to eat in the dining room. So... Last time I tried to cook something, the world was almost destroyed by the food monster. I wish Ben didn't put his chemicals on the shelves along with the sugar and the salt. Nothing edible inside. Can you... Yeah, okay, you wanna eat or not? Like... There we go. What a mockery of real food. Is it all they can offer these days? You should try wallpapers, dear child. They are especially rich in iron. Don't listen to him. Soap is much better in nutrition. Um, guys, do I get a say in this? Aliens don't really have a concept of personal space, do they? By the way, Mr. Aiden. The door to the ground floor corridor doesn't open. It's closed for minor construction works, nothing to worry about. If you come out at night, you might find something interesting here. Aiden pinches Bennett. Ow! Stop giving the child weird ideas. Don't listen to him, weird, uh, dear girl. If you want to join in, I'll be watching SoapNet in the TV room. Soap operas just call for soap milkshakes. Bennett leaves. It just disappears, okay. <laughs> just disintegrates. I almost forgot. Come to the dissection room later, I have a favor to ask of you. Aiden and Huxley leave too. Um... Dissection room? It wasn't locked yesterday. That's the TV room. Is this the dissection room? What's 2 plus 2? 5. Can you prove that? If not, access denied. God damn. 4, of course. If you are free to make that statement, then it is correct. You may pass. This ladder leads to the basement. Mm, I forgot where I put the basement key. Nothing of interest here. Nothing of interest here. Nothing of interest here. Nothing of interest here. I need to go outside right now. The ladder leads to the first floor. Do you want to go up? How do I get to the dissection room? I'm guessing it's this room that's locked. I guess I can't right now. Bennett is, ab is absorbed in watching TV. Um, is the dissection room my own room? Oh, right, I can use... No? Wait, aren't I carrying soap? Um, where am I supposed to go? I need to go outside right now. Shit. I need to call anyone right now. Fuck. What? 
Do you wanna- oh wait, I just realized the game still says Duck Simulator. Um... There we go. Um, nothing inside here. Oh, let me see. Basement, the section room, tailoring room, test rooms. Ground floor, living rooms. Okay, so I need to find the basement key. I think. Which I'm not sure where it is. Maybe it's in, like... There it is. Okay. Wait, I'm losing health. For what purpose? Wait, no, I'm not. What? Don't let anyone fool you. 2 plus 2 is 5. No matter what they say. Sewing tools are stored inside. Sewing tools are stored inside. Open me. Open the box. Yep, this seems fishy, although I'm so curious. Yeah, no, I wanted to... I want to open it. Yes, open it. Opens the box. Suddenly everything collapses into a singularity. Sudden end. Destroyed the world in less than a second. <laughs> Try again? Yes. Wait. I couldn't save the whole time. Are you fucking kidding me? It's fine, this won't take too long. Save now. Uh, okay, that's action room. Basement. Cool, I'm back. Build the fabric. Build the fabric. Okay. Wait, let's go to this room first. Oh, hi. Uh, oh, never mind. This is the right room. Um, this is the wrong room. Tailoring room. Aiden loves, uh, loves order. Even his mannequins are in place. Hi, Mr. Aiden. Being, uh, being a busybody as always. Hello, dear girl. If there's a dress I want you to try on... Wait, there's a dress I want you to try on if you don't mind. I'd love to. I put on the, uh, the, t uh, the dress the tailor made. Oh, it's silly rad. It's called White Spotted Jellyfish Dress. It still needs a few f uh, finishing touches. I'll give it to you when it's ready. Wait. A polka dot dress. I dress is prettier than the one next to it. Yet another polka dot dress. A simple black and white dress. They're all black and white. 
a polka dot dress, another polka dot dress, a pretty dress. Alright. And this is the room I need to be in. Do it yourself. Heart massage. Everything you wanted to know about uh, strength theory, but fear to ask. The selfish gene. Bad science. The man who mistook his life for a hat. Oh, finally, some books I've read. Uh, craving paper. Embrace your inner pika. The almanac of official history. What to do if your daughter brings home uranium? Access denied, of course. Huxley is busy dissecting a corpse. Pres presumably it was w human once. Hi, I'm Dr. Huxley. Hello, little Charlotte. About the little talk we had earlier, can you do me a favor of looking after my lovely nephew for a couple of days? I've been so busy working on the cure for eye plague that I can't help, that I can't keep an eye on him at all. For all I know, he, he could be collecting rare specimens in broad daylight right now. He's too passionate for his own good. Aren't you too passionate for your own good yourself? The main reason why I'm worried about him, however, is that he has no sense of direction, you see. He may have a bad attitude, but don't let that get to you. Okay, I'll help. Felix, come here. Ugh. I don't need anyone to look after me, Uncle Huxley. Right, right. Now go play with your new big sister. Uncle has science to do. There he goes again. It's nice to meet you, Felix. I'm Charlotte. Hi. If you, uh... If you want to make it through the day... Don't you dare invite my, invade my personal space. Wow, I can almost feel his glare blurring into my skin. This is going to be a long day. Your location uh, in the section were not available. New tasks... Re Wait, new tasks receive kill time. I thought that said kill me. Umbrella man. He appeared out of nowhere when I was a child. Whenever I was in kindergarten or the library with mom or alone in my room, he was always there, watching me with his yellow eyes from the darkest corner of the room, not uttering a single word. When I tried to tell mother about him, he lifted the finger to his lips, as if not wanting me to speak. So, I didn't. In my book of truth, I called him the Observer. As soon as I defined him, the man spoke for the first time. Oh, that name is not bad, I must say. He remarked. However, wouldn't anyone who watches over you become an observer? I had to agree. Hmm, then I'll call you the Umbrella Man. Slightly taken aback, the man coughed. Ahem. <clears throat> Although I would have preferred a more euphonic name, let, let it stay this way. Since then, I gave every new person I met in the house a distinctive name. User log, the Umbrella Man 2. When Mom asked who I was talking to, I didn't tell her about the Umbrella Man. Who said I told a lie. Oh, that's it. My birthday, okay. On the day of my 10th birthday, the, uh, the doorbell rang in the middle of the night. A masked man wearing a uh, tofa and a black suit was standing behind the door. Hello, little Charlotte. He said with the smile of a man who offers children candies. Jesus Christ, that is creepy. Mother told me not to talk to strangers. I answered in a determined voice. He let out a sigh. I'm no strangers to you. Human memory is so ephemeral, isn't it? Even if I do know you, you must be a bad guy, I insisted. Me? Bad? Why so? I had to come up with something. That's because all their- all their- pfft, That's because all villains wear tofats. Oh, is that so? What a silly prejudice. The man commented with a small laugh. 
Don't let disappearance fool you. With those words, he took off the mask. As I thought, the man was none other than the Umbrella Man himself. Although I'd love to have a chat with you on your significant day of the year, I came for another reason. I tilted my head curious. Listen closely, little one. I came to inform you that a puppeteer has been assigned uh, has been assigned to you. You've reached the age of 10. Who's that? They are a representative of the true realm, designed specifically to watch over your troublesome species. The one assigned to you is a Seth-type puppeteer. As for their purpose, they are here to guide you. The puppet... They're here to guide you, the puppets, through your short lives. Why would they do that? You see, little one, free will is fiction. Mm-hmm. I chewed on my words, trying to come up with a smart reply. Ah, this choice of words must have been too difficult for a child. Let me put it another way. Uh, meet your new friend who will watch over you. Their name is Seth. Don't bully them too much, okay? Soap Bible. So your son is an alien? How to raise your IQ by watching soap operas. I'm not sure about the usefulness of the second book. If IQ stands for Im imbecility quotient, the title is rather accurate. Accurate, yeah. The Complete Guide to Conquering the Universe. Uh, 425th fault, uh, Fail Proof Edition. Cannibal man set free. <sighs> Human encyclopedias, the complete edition. Clinical surgery for dummies. 1,000 human diseases to die from. Are human diseases deadly to you? Actually, no. We can develop symptoms similar to a human cold, though. Oh, found some books I've read. Oh, she, there's no, uh... Still busy, Mr. Aiden? Hello, little Charlotte and Felix. Since you're here, would you mind trying on some clothing? What a pain. Charlotte covers Felix's mouth with her hand. Of course we do. A pretty dress. Popular dress. Uh, I guess. Want to try it on? What do you take me for? A dress up doll? Aiden loves order. Even his mannequins are in place. I guess there isn't anything to do here. Is there anywhere I can save? Read books, visit closed rooms, talk to the tenants. Oh, wait, it's saved. <gasps> oh, I can just save like that, okay. I can, I can open these. Access granted. Oh, hi. What's this squishy? A specimen for research and an organ supply. But do not touch. Don't tell me what to do. I guess I can't touch it. Never mind. Move aside. The door scans the boy's eye. Access granted. Test lab. Open the door and die. Survive and get a prize. Wow, is it for real? Want to check? Hold on, let me save first. Open one. Door one, nothing happens. Open another door two. Door two opens. Bang! Bad end. Darwin Award. Well, that happened. At least I can load. 
So it's door three. Wait, 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 what? Um, so how do I survive? Nothing happens. And door two? No, I can't. Is there a way for me to survive this? I mean, I guess there is. Door two. Door three. What does this say? One door out of the three leads to death. That's a lie. Spooky. Bleh. Well, hope you enjoy the Monty Hall room. Wait, one door out of three leads to death? That's not true, because it's actually two out of three. It's like... Wait. Ah, got an azure ribbon. So that's how it works. Okay. Interesting. Actually, looks very busy. What's this? Wait here. Um, so this is where Bennett's crew works. Pretty much, stuff usually blows up in here, so it has restricted as access. His name appears to be Baldwin. I want to talk to you. Talk to- Talk to this motherfucker. Talk- You fucking cunt. Get over here. It's- An- Antoinette. This person has no suit label. It's Franklin. That's Lecter. Hello, Florence. What's up? We discovered that adding dark matter to- Uh, the dough improves- Improves the taste of a chocolate cake by 15%. Don't tell anyone. Okie dokie. It's Franklin. This guy has... Ar Archibald written on his suit label. Move. You fucking bastard. Get out. Move. This person has no suit label. He's Goodwin. Uh, it's Godwin, actually. Antoinette. Alright. Also, wait, wait, wait. I saw some some drawers. Um, uh, found tongue terror. Take it. No, put it back. Just d <laughs> right. Should have known. This one's a fake anyway. God damn, they're not fun. Nothing of interest here. What's this? They're watching. Hmm. I've always been... I've always considered a possibility of being watched. It's a pretty plaus... Uh, it is pretty plausible if we take into account all the conspiracy theories. Alright. Oh, wait. I can go outside? This door is locked. I don't want to disturb my neighbors. Door, door is locked. I wonder what this door leads to. You and your curiosity. Fine, I'll open it. Oh, god damn. Hold up. Whoa, we're in outer space. Satisfied? Yep. Uh, no, not yet. I want to see what this is. Found something nice. Take it? Yes. Helix Neb Nebula Ownership. Wow. I hereby proclaim myself the Empress of the Helix Nebula. How does that sound? Utterly cheesy. Can't go here. Can't go here. Alright. Wasn't locked yesterday.
Well, Big Sis is going to sleep. How about you? I do not require sleep. I'll grab a bottle of soap and measure your brain waves while you sleep, stupid human. Sounds like a plan. I suppose I don't have to accompany you to, to the bathroom. No way in hell. Go to sleep already. Good night. Wait, I wanted to... I'm too sleepy to go out. Fuck, wait, I should have talked to the fucker first. Um... Alright, let me see. Oh, there we go. This guy. Bennett looks sad. Hi, Bennett. Are you dead or something? After 1037 episodes and 10 specials, they finally confessed their undying love to each other. Underneath my protection suit, I'm dying from complicated feelings. <laughs> Let's leave him until he's ready to return to the harsh reality, shall we? Well. Um, I don't think, I don't think they planned for that, okay. Anyway, go to sleep. Well, I'm off to bed, good night. Hello Charlotte, nice, yeah. Good night, Seth. Something slimy crawls into the room. Bro. Oh, it's just my maggot cat. One day, my cat turned into a maggot. Or was he a maggot all along that turned into a cat? You just started to a nice. Hello, by the way. Hey, that kid, how you doing? Uh, the mag cat uh, states as it makes itself comfortable on my bed. Good. Good cat. Oh, it's so adorable. Charlotte pets the mag cat. It purrs. Charlotte falls asleep peacefully. Oh my god, that is loud. What was that sound? Felix wants to come back soon, too. Did he get lost in the house? How about we go look for him? Uh, can... Please be careful, consider taking pepper spray. Can I take pepper spray? Um... A flamethrower would be more effective, don't you think? Admittedly so. It's such a mess. I'm guessing it's the TV room because... Alright, Felix is not here. Also, hi. Bennett is snoring in his sleep. Felix is not here. Felix is not here. Fun. Can I go in... I can. Uh... The cover glass is missing. Go in. No. I want to see what's, what's here first. Door one open. Never mind. No, I want to explore the house first. What is the meaning of life? If only I knew. Okay, never mind. I can't do this. I mean, the meaning of life is just waiting for death, isn't it? Yes, go in. Felix couldn't have gone here, could he? What is this place? I don't remember our, our house having a direct passage to a prince's castle. It's too dark to see anything. Will you find what you will find what you need upstairs? That's cool. What is this? I wonder why they bear toys everywhere. These toys are kind of cute. It's raining. It's pouring. The old bear is growling. I can't see shit. Like, it's so dark that you can't make out what anything is. Take the lantern. Okay, there we go. Problem solved. Oh, well, this is different. I wonder why there are bear toys everywhere. Pull. 
Hmm, it didn't do anything. The ultimate guide to skinning and gutting homo sapiens. Cooking with passion. Human taxidermy. Going wild. Uh, hunting human rights and contested meaning of nature. Thyroid gland 101 festive recipes. It will do something, alright? I'm guessing it'll kill me. Now this is creepy. How is it raining? The ultimate guide to skinning and gutting homo sapiens cooking with passion. Just a yellow teddy bear, nothing scary at all. A crack in the wall. A low growl is coming from it. Rain, rain, go away, little teddy wants to play. Is it my imagination or did its eyes move? Oh, this is creepy. Same fucking thing. Cool. Hi. Oh shit. Bad end. Little Teddy wants to play. It's a good thing I saved, because I kind of thought that would happen. Give me that lantern, right now. Because I am not going to be here in the dark. Um. So... Is pulling on that... Oh, wait, 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 wait. What if? What if? What if? What if? I think I know. No! Fuck! Got stuck! No, 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 no. Because I think... Give me that. Go over here. Make little teddy play. That was not helpful. Thank you, Charlotte. Let's try this again. Okay, you know what? I might as well just save right in front of this. Cool. Hmm. Did it do anything? Uh. I guess it did. Because the bear isn't here anymore. Open the door. Bad end. Shot to death. Wow. Okay. Sure. So, I guess that didn't do anything because the music didn't even stop when I pulled on that. Um, wait, unless... Never mind. I thought maybe pulling the lever was the reason I got shot, but nope. Nope. Nope, none of that. Absolutely not. Um, oh, wait. No! You fuck. What if I need to make it up there and have the bear get shot? Somehow, I'm not quite sure how I'm gonna be able to do that because this thing is way too fucking fast, but yeah. Uh... Fuck. Yeah, no, this thing is faster than I, than I ever will be. Is there, an, is there a faster way to get up there? Is there something to... Does that have something to do with this lever, maybe? Didn't do anything? And now I open this? Nope, still shot. How do I do this?
Bring me go away, they'll tell you what's to play. You'll find what you need upstairs, but there is nothing upstairs because if I go upstairs, I get shot. The only thing I find is a bullet to the face. I'm gonna backseat here. Fantastic. Do I have something? I have an Azure Ribbon. What does it do? Uh, wait. How do I get it back? Shit. Did I just waste a, an item? Um, Yo, Teddy wants to play. What if I go? I guess I can try going to this room and then pull this, which didn't do anything. And actually, it's raining here now. And now if I leave, the bear is gone. And now it's raining even, even more. And the teddy bear is back. I wonder why there are bear toys everywhere. I think you know the answer to that. I see, so I'm supposed to go in the room, not pull the lever, or pull the rope. And then I'm supposed to go upstairs. Or not. Uh, it said other though when you pulled the thing with the bear. It did. Yeah, it said mmm, but that didn't do anything. And I still get shot when I go upstairs. The other one? Yeah, no, I know, but... It still just says, mmm. And then when I go here... Bang. She didn't think... She didn't think... She didn't think of... It didn't do anything. Yeah, but then when I go to the other rope... It just... Respawns... The bear, and I achieve nothing. Okay. I mean, it's raining even harder now. Check the hole.
I don't hear the sounds anymore. Let's enter. Oh. Cabbages and tomatoes. It's an oven. A sink. So... She doesn't hear the sounds in the hole anymore. But if you pull the rope, the bear spawns from the hole. Make it make sense. Backdoor key. Nice. Oh, hi. Uh, also, I'm gonna save because I don't want to do that again. A bug, probably. Oh. The little girl's eyes well up with tears at the sight of Charlotte. Hmm, I'm very sorry. Can I help you somehow? Are you lost? Aren't you lost yourself, big sister? That hurt? Leave. Fred doesn't talk to strangers. What a bitch. Um. Uh, Midnight's Bear Cubs. Nothing of interest inside. Wait. The bears and men. Or of men. I don't know. The lovely lo the the lovely honey. There you go. Nothing of interest inside. These are rabbit toys, take it. Why'd you need another one? Hush, it's cute. <laughs> You're only gonna take one and just leave the other? Nothing of interest inside. Bear factory. Bear factory. The girl's eye is light up at the sight of the rabbit toy. Want me to give it to you? Can I have it? Sure, here you go. Thank you. Your eyes look like egg whites. I'll take that as a compliment, I guess. I'm looking for a little boy. He must have lost his way in this place, too. Have you seen him by any chance? No. There's no one but Freya. I see. He must be very lonely. Also, what was this noise? I feel like a jump scare is about to happen. Hm. Freya is fine on her own anyway. Get lost already if you're not going to stay. Is this the unlock? The thing that unlock? The prints are lined up nicely. Wait, actually. Only forward. Fuck. The bearer of the ring shall pass. These aren't alive, are they? Don't look in the mirror. Well, don't tell me what to do. I need to find the key. The cat room. Hey, kitty. Don't drink from the right cup. Don't tell me what to do. I feel dizzy. Um. Wait. Wait. These flowers are pretty. Don't drink from the left cup. Oh. I drank from the cup already. The flames are dancing in the fireplace. Go inside, go in. The fire embraces me. Oh. Wait, what? Ring obtained. Dizzy, dizzy, can you hear me? Wait, why is it still there? But it's not moving. Oh. God damn. Bad end. Burn to, burn to death. I don't know what I expected. <laughs> Alright, let's drink from the left cup. I feel dizzy. So they do the same thing or... Uh... Go in. What? Oh, I see. So, if you, depending on what cup you drink from, 
the the fire is I want, I want that the blue sugar high <laughs> Enter the right fireplace. I was actually I'm actually not that big of a fan of blue sugar if I'm being honest. I feel like it's one of the weaker like original songs in the end. These flowers are pretty. I'm drinking from the right cup too like I already did. Find a key. Well, I am the bearer of the key. So, uh, window seems to open from the other side. Take a break. Have a break. Have a Kit Kat. Unlock the door. Wait, the door doesn't open. Fuck. Oh. I don't know, that's like the only part of the song I like. That and the start. Hmm. Yeah. I don't get, like, the... Like, you know how the, like, it says, I want that, that. Like, why does it say that twice? Like, it's... I don't know. I feel like they were just... They, like, came up with the beat, and then they didn't know how to, like, follow the beat. So they had to, like, say that twice. Eat the porridge. Okay. Not this again. What's wrong? The default clock sound. Who even uses that anymore? Please, let's leave this horrible place as soon as we find Felix. Big porridge ball. Oh, makes me feel kind of hungry. Eat it? No. Yep, I'd better not. There are still butterflies in my stomach after that tea blend in the cat room. Porridge is too cold. Ew. Porridge was delicious. I wish there was more of it. Wait, what? Tick tock, tick tock. Each had a porridge ball, a chair, and a bed. They were honest, good natured, trusting bears. One day, a girl came into the house. She could not have been a she could not have been a good, honest little girl. For the first, she, for first, she peeped in the keyhole, and seeing nobody in the house, she lifted the latch. According to the lyrics, it's "I want that that blue sugar high." So it's supposed to be another sentence. God damn it, Ren. The curtains are heavy. Sit on the chair? Which chair? Oh, there's only one. Okay. On the silver key. Sit on the sofa. It's too hard. Like my dick. Um... Chair looks comfy. It's too soft. Not comfy at all. Is on the chair? Oops, it broke. Have I gained weight lately? That's clipped. Honestly, I... You ate my porridge. You sat in my chair. Oh, shit. You've been a bad, bad girl. Uh, well. Oh, hey, I'm back here. The bear room. I hope there aren't any actual bears out there. Oh, let me actually go in here. I, I wanna, I wanna see. Hello. Just so it looks like you could move any second. Probably will. White flowers are my favorite. There's a key under the napkin. Oh. Oh, they have the 25th edition of the sci-fi uh, Alma uh, Almanac. Can we take it, please? It's too heavy for you to carry. Listen, we didn't come here for treasure hunting. You can... It's too heavy for you to carry. <laughs> Can't you carry it? My physical body is in another realm. All you can do is order me around. Right. Charlotte puts the book back. Take the sci-fi Almanac. Fine. Take it, you stupid bitch. 
Also, what's this? Don't tell me that that was... I, was that supposed to be the sci-fi almanac? White flowers are my favorite. The teddies grab me from the shelves. Nothing of interest here. It's dark outside the window. Door doesn't open. Can we use something? Shit. Um. Oh, there we go. Little Teddy wants to play. So. Were we not supposed to take the almanac? Is that what it is about? Oh, hey, they have 25. Um. We didn't come here for treasure hunting. You're so boring. But puts the book back. Maybe that's what it was. Door doesn't open. Ah. Um. Alright. So. You're gonna take it. High five for a fellow nerd. You high five with Charlotte. There's a key under the napkin. Wait, is the... Use the bronze key, there we- the key doesn't fit. Um... Then I think that went through. So... Is this room just not possible right now? Take the almanac. Oh, well. Uh... Oh, wait. There was a bookshelf that they... That the bear was blocking. Maybe I need to... Go on that, perhaps. Okay. Let me rewind. Let me like save and solve for. Fuck. So what can you throw these nuts um in that room uh did i already yeah okay i already took these Do i need to throw something I can throw stuff. Do I throw the almanac? I mean, apparently it is heavy. Throw the almanac at the bear? Oh. Phew, it worked. Never, underest never underestimate the power of words. Toys are moving. Uh, can I take the almanac again? Nope. Alright. Take a break. 
Have a break, have a Kit Kat. Don't look in the mirror, well don't tell me what to do. Uh, rewind point. Unlock the door. The mirror shows the future. Oh, hi. Whoa, this feels... This feels photoshopped. Uh, trust me, I've seen photoshopped things before. This... <laughs> Just don't look photoshopped. Well, I've uh, looked in the mirror. The bear, the little polar bear, Paddington bear. Gone with the honey to kill a rabbit. Okay. Turn on. I mean, what does the lyrics from Wish of This Songbird even mean? What the fuck does that mean? Uh, I mean, at least there it's supposed to be like a made up language, right? So, I mean, you can forgive that. Because, like, it's supposed to be like a hell, like a. Like her just taking over hell. And plus, like, it's memeable as fuck, too. Valley of the Bears, hibernate and grow rich. The girl with the bear tattoo. The Lord of the Bear, the Bear, the Witch in the Wardrobe, Bear in Peace. Rupert Bear, Winnie the Pooh. The Life of Times and Grid, Grim, Grizzly Adams. No, I didn't mean to talk about it again. Fun fact, I, I actually didn't know this. Winnie the Pooh apparently uh, is public domain now. That's interesting. The mirror shows the hidden. The door is closed. Wait, hold on. The door is closed. I guess I can't do this yet. Da kinina heya kru sohineria turanu. Eat the porridge. Which porridge? Not this again. What's wrong? The default clock sound. Who uses that anymore? It's too cold. Ew. It's too hot. My tongue burns. The girl came to her house, she could not have been a good honest little girl for the first time she peeped into a keyhole and seeing nobody in the house, she lifted the latch. Oops, it broke. Have I gained weight lately? Probably. Silver key. Then you make one hell of a, uh, of a base in the choir. Another... Another one of mine, let's go. What? Door doesn't open. Uh, go here. Somebody has been at my porridge. Ah, shit. Upon... One, uh, well, too late. Once upon a time, there three bears. A little small wee bear, a middle-sized bear, and a great huge bear. And one of them killed me. The end. That's the end of the story. Once upon a time, there three bears. Uh, that's it? That, that's all you have to say? Cool. So do I not sit on anything? Uh, I know how the three bear story ended. What about you? The bears killed the intruder. <laughs> I mean, that is how it ended. <laughs> yeah. You know, in a choir, people are separated because of their voice. Some are higher, some are lower. So, some of them all, it makes a beautiful union of voices. I don't think 
I don't think I would fit in then. <laughs> uh, the bears killed the intruder. No, she left through the window, but we're not. But we're not in a fairy tale. Intruder killed the bears. Yes, but we're not in a fairy tale. You, fu you stupid ass bitch. Sleep on the bed. Okay. Which bed? Tableware. Some some herbs. Boring. So, do I sleep on this bed or this bed? Which bed? Lay on it. It's too high at, uh, at the foot for me. It's too high at the foot for me. God damn. You short ass fuck. If she had been a good girl, she would have waited for the bears to invite her into the, into the house. But they were good bears. For they were good bears, but she was rude, bad little girl. I can sing, just need to learn. Use a reason for this, the only free instrument, and you don't use it properly. I guess. So I guess I have to. I guess I have to eat the porridge. And then sit on the chair. Oh wait, maybe I'm supposed to sit on the chair before eating the porridge? Oh, whoops. Because I guess the porridge makes her fat or something. Let's try this. Nope, never mind. At least I got a silver key. You sat in my chair. Shit. Somebody's been on my porridge. You know what you're gonna do about it, bitch. Tick tock, tick tock. Fucking hate tick tock. Son of a bitch. Okay. Uh, I need this key. Nothing of interest here. Somebody has been sitting in my chair. <sighs> what the fuck? It doesn't open? I didn't think so. I'm pretty sure the silver key won't work. Yep, I didn't think so. Um. So, how am I gonna do this? Ah, bitch. Oh. Somebody has been lying in my bed. I didn't do that. Lay on it. It's too high at the foot. Table or some herbs. Boring.
how am I gonna get out of this? Um, somebody has been sitting in my chair. Oh, I just need to be in all three rooms. Is that what it is? Nope. 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 Definitely not. Nope. Okay. Wait, I need to... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Apparently... Wait, wait, wait. She left through the window, right? That's what happens in the fairy tale. But, uh, is there a window anywhere? No, there's a clock. There's a big fat clock. Uh, window. Nope. No, no window. Are there any windows anywhere? No. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Open the curtains. The window is painted on the wall. Shit. There's a wall behind the curtain. Well, that's amazing. Open the curtains, yes. There we go. The window seems to open from the other side. <laughs> yeah. So don't go back in there. Um, alright, so... Now that I have the silver key... And save over this because I know I want to do it again. Unlock the door. Alright. Oh! There's nothing in here. Or is there? Um, it looks like there's too much in here. There you are, little burglar. Choose the room you will await your punishment in. The lion room, torture room, oxygen room. Mmm... Must do... Lion. The lions haven't eaten for a long time. Oh. I was expecting like a bad ending or something, but... Torture room. This day can't get any worse, right? So, by torture room, they didn't mean that I'd be tortured here. This room doesn't look any different from the others, though. Wow. Error. What's wrong, Seth? I'm having problems with the program. Does that mean I can do what I want? No, I simply can't access the rewind menu. Well, that's too bad. No turning back. Well, uh, channel doesn't work. Channel doesn't work. Seems like we can go in. Logic error. Felix? You? Uh... Head poke him. Ow, 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 what are you doing, stupid? Your punishment for running off. I thought I'd never find you. Felix growls. Shouldn't have followed me. Small talk aside, how'd you get here? I, uh, got lost in your house. 
There's no way I'm buying that. Anyhow, we need a plan. I'm not going to sit around and wait until the uh, bears use us for crappy taxidermy. The bears? What are you talking about? Weren't you captured by them too? Excuse me? I just got here and I have no clue what you're talking about. Anyhow, you really needn't have followed me. Do you have any weapons on you at all? Only books. Seth is against violence. No, I'm not. I'm fully for it. Please excuse me while I slam my head against my forehead. Good thing we met up before you couldn't get into any more trouble. Fine, fine, I get it. Sorry for being a burden. Well, there's nothing you can do about it now. Still, what were you really doing here? Well, there's a high probability of an oracle who has taken... Uh, who has taken physical form appearing in this dimension. Such as... Such an occurrence happens only once in several millenniums. An oracle? What's that? For you, they are an equal to gods. In short, they are entities capable of creating small universe. I won't go into details for now. It's not like you, your puny brain could comprehend it all. They sound like fun. What's this? Security drone, presumably. This one seems broken. Ah. Uh -huh. Found something nice. Take it. Take it. Found BGM change. Opening the boxes is meaningless. Uh. Let's die. Oh, never mind. Um, you wanna... Is this supposed to be a security drone? Because it, it isn't doing its job. Found something nasty. Take it. Take it. As a ribbon. That's nasty? I mean, yeah, I guess it is nasty. It's blue instead of green. Yeah, you're right. It couldn't get any worse, can it? Can it? Lies are written in capital letters. Interesting. See no evil, speak no evil, hear no evil, have no fun. No fun allowed. Knock knock. Who's there? Guns are nasty. Take it. Gasp! Made all drones deadly. Guns are nasty. Take it. Take it. There's nothing in the box. There's nothing in the box. What if I talk this again? Made all drones deadly. Black hole. And I was just about to save too. Well. That is fantastic. Great. I go to the oxygen room. The room is filled with pure oxygen, making it impossible to breathe. Wait, I thought... Huh? I thought it would remove oxygen. Not... Have oxygen. Torture room. Okay, you know what? While, uh, looking through stuff, I might as well just... Okay, never mind. Go over here. Oh, I can't rewind. Um... 
Oh, well, hello there. Uh, hug him. I found you. Don't worry, Big Sis is here to help. Can't breathe. Stop this irrational display of affection D this instant. Small talk aside, how did you get here? Okay. I can't rewind anymore. Fantastic. Okay, so I guess I can't save. Gas, middle drones deadly. So now if I go over here, will I get a... Guess not? Are you... There we go. Yep. I'm not a fan of the fact that, uh, I can't save here. Um... What if I go over here? This door is missing a doorknob. Let's look around. Ah, so this is a save. Okay. So, I guess I might as well. No, I did not mean to go back in there, please. So what if I open the boxes? Find a joke. You can't shoot us all. No, but I can shoot you. Bad end. Funny joke. That was pretty funny. I can't even deny. That was hilarious. They're still laughing. They're still laughing. BGM change. Gasp, middle drones deadly. Fuck. I found duct tape. What is this? Soap. Well, hi. That's so nice. Take it, take it. Doodles. Ah. Oh, well, now the drones aren't deadly. There's nothing in the box. Just like my soul, there is nothing in there. What's this? Security drone, presumably. This one's broken. Alright. No, I want to... Wait, what? Did that say... Take it. Take everything. Take everything. I obtained a black hole. Fuck. Load. Alright. Take it. Duct tape. Take it. Take that. That was the black hole. Fuck. Took the wrong thing. Or are they both black holes? I don't remember. Is this a black hole? No, that's an Azuri. Okay. Take this. Take this. Okay. Save here. Do those. Gas. Middle Jones deadly. Fuck. No! I wanted that.
hate this bitch. Um. Which one was the was the Maidel Jones deadly? That one. Okay. And now we save. Answer the questions. Door remains closed. Hall of Ignorance. Enter. Yeah. Yeah, this would have been drone hell. Question one. Two plus one. Twenty-one, obviously. Can you move? Can you fucking move? There's a notebook that looks out of place. Read it? Yes. Once upon a time... Once upon a time, there lived a tiny god. The tiny god created a tiny universe filled with tiny people. The tiny people created more tiny people and tiny things. Engaged in tiny wars and became... And became tiny piles of dust. Happy end. Sounds about right. Sounds like the plot of Wakfu. Oh my god. They are always watching. I know. I'm aware. Oh no. How long is this fucking thing? They're always watching. Wait, did I just loop? I did. Unless... No, no, I didn't. Oh, there we go. Oh, my head. No, go back. Fuck. Oh yeah, no, this is just a looping hall. Fantastic. Move! Oh. Oh, this sucks. Oh no. Oh my god, get out of the way! So my future self. See no evil, speak no evil, hear no evil, have no fun. Can you move out of the fucking way? Why'd they make their movements completely random? Why? I'm going to stab you. Get the fuck out of my face. Question four? The red of <laughs> shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Derivative of e to the power of five. Your mom. That's just unfair. Too easy. The answer is zero. Oh, okay. Thank you. Move. Move, you cunt. Move. Question two. Turn nine upside down. What number do you get? Six. Move you cunt. K. 
Can you move, you fucking asshole? How did we end up here? I feel sick from this illogical bullshit. Okay, so that's three, six, and the fourth number is zero. Question three. What's less than six and more than four? Five. Okay, so three, six, five, five, zero. Three, six, five, zero. That's the, that's the code. All right. Oh my God, I never want to do this again. This one sucked. All of ignorance. Oh my god, hold on. So three, six, five, zero. Oh my god, that one sucked. That one is awful, awful. Nothing in the box. Dramatic snow effect. Ooh, nice. Another dramatic snow effect. Found a joke. I'm not schizophrenic, just multi-face. <laughs> Gasp, made all drones deadly. Shit. This box is surprisingly heavy. Open it. Found a doorknob. Oh, there we go. But I want I don't want the drones to be deadly, so I'm going to try this again. Um, where the fuck did the game go? Why did the game crash before even opening? Uh, which one was the deadly one? Nothing in the box. That one. That's what- that's the one it was. Found a joke. You're so fucking funny. And there we go. All right. It fits. Open the door. Yes. So what's this? Uh, I see what this is, yeah. Okay. Um, I closed. Then, uh, left, right, up, up, left, right, up. This is a code for something, I know it is. This is gonna be like a looping hallway. Or something like that. Something similar. Password required four. I didn't memorize it well that well, sorry. I'll enter it then. Um wait, hold on. What? <gasps> ah too bad. I was supposed to mem Oh this sucks. Oh this sucks. Okay. It's worse than I thought. Hold on. So So, I close. Wait, why is the I close? Left. Right. Wait. Huh? 
And so left, right, up. No. Hold on. Uh, am I supposed to memorize the number of eyes in in this in these two rooms? Well, let me just take a picture while I'm at it. I might as well. Uh, I see. Okay, so there is different eyes here. No, I did not mean to do that. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, no. Um. How do I do this one? I actually have no idea. Hold on. So... I think I kind of get it. It's... Three... Then left... No. No, 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 wait, 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 I think it's from, yeah, 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 I think, I think that's actually what it is, and then it's, when I clicked on this channel, I expected you to have at least 2,000 subs, no, <laughs> uh, that would be too easy, <laughs> no, <laughs> no, you think people like me, <laughs> try again, So then up. Uh, so then it's one. Three. One. Two. No way. I, I bullshitted that. Oh. I mean, I mean, I guess it worked. His head, gone. This can't be. Can we do something? It's... It's no use. No matter what you do, you'll end up dying here in one way or another. Who are you? The four-eyed person lets out a laugh. Stop making that face, it doesn't suit you. I'm a librarian, but you see... Nobody comes to read anymore. Anyhow, there's no use crying over dead meat. How oh, could you? I promised to look after him, yet... There, there. Not all is lost, aside from this person's head, I guess. Wait, wait, don't hit me for that. What do you suggest I do then? Switch the channel. That's all. How would that help me? You'll see for yourself. Perhaps you'll get lucky enough to change history. Why should I trust you? I'm not telling you to do something unthinkable, am I? Besides, I'm quite knowledgeable about this place, but about how this place works. Ah, sorry. I am enjoying myself too much. It's the first time I've talked to an actual person in years. This door is open, aren't you in a hurry? Right. Goodbye, then. Bye-bye. Be careful. If you meet the executioners on your way, they won't be nice like me. Charlotte averts her eyes. 
Enter TV. Might as well. I want to save. Sound doesn't work. This sound doesn't work. And this sound doesn't work. How am I gonna change the channel if none of them work? Try to switch the. Ch That's how. Okay. Turnout must be around here. Oh yeah, we saw it earlier, didn't we? It's the same fucking. Oh no, never mind. Okay, nope. Box is empty. Oh wait, actually, there's no drones. Wait, are... Oh! Bad end. Funny joke. Huh? Excuse the shit out of me? You're still laughing. I'm literally in a different timeline. So is every box just empty? That's so funny. In this really it really is me unless I open the boxes. I don't care. I'll open them. All of them. Take it. Box is empty. Take it. Take them all. Open them. All of them. Answer the questions. I need to look around uh, more before going in there. Hall of Knowledge. Not this again. Felix? You. It... Is it really you? What kind of question is that? Of course it's me. I just got here. Is that so? Hey, why are you crying? Uh, small. Charlotte turns away for a moment. You must be imagining it. I'm just glad you're safe and sound. You like size. Is that so? Anyhow, uh, you do not have to follow me. I pinch Felix's cheek. It's my duty to look after you, dummy. Don't underestimate me and my amazing caretaker skills. I thought you were going to scold me for running off. Came here for a reason, right? I won't scold you. Just. Stay safe. Okay, I guess. You're acting weird. You're imagining things. Take my hand so that we won't get separated, okay? Psst. Absolutely unnecessary. No objections allowed, as Seth likes to say. Question 1, 2 plus... Okay, please tell me this is the same. Because I do not want to do all of this again. Oh, hi. It's you. Thanks for earlier. It really did work. It really did work. The switching channel thing. May I ask, do I know you? You don't remember me? I believe it's the first time we've met. Uh, I'm really sorry. I must have mistaken you for someone I knew. That's no surprise. We all look the same to you. I'm very sorry. 
No need to apologize. Is there a book you need to find? Perhaps I can be of assistance uh, to my fellow bilofine, bilofines, whatever that means. I do my best to keep everything in order in here, you know? Rather than a book, is there a safe exit? All exits here are safe. It's a library after all. Uh, is that so? Question two. Nah, that's six. No, I don't. I don't want to. Stab someone. Knock, knock. Oh, wait. Is it just the bookshelves that have a missing book? That would make things so much easier if it was. The moment people enter this place, they'll burn it to ashes. Why did they do that? Don't you know? Keeping books is a great sin. Everything has to be rewritten. Some books here, however, store information that hasn't been changed for one month. Isn't that amazing? Isn't that too short of a time period? What would you do if they find you? They already did. I made sure no one came back. <laughs> that was a joke. I'm in the middle of setting up a better security system. The concept uh, is that it might lure in... It might lure you in like an RPG game. <laughs> kind of is. But then you'll find yourself unable to get out. Why am I not surprised? You might think I'm being paranoid, but everyone is like that these days. Anything else? Your name. Can I ask your name? Name? I'm afraid I don't have one. Well, how should I call you then? Hmm. Males of our species are called Frey, so you can call me that. Frey it is then. You can call me Charlotte. Charlotte? The free one, huh? That's a beautiful name. I'll remember it. I guess I can't talk to him again. Question four. The answer would be zero, right? Wow, you're actually capable of calculus. Who would have thought? Well, not really. Question three. Five. One day, she stepped into the paper kingdom. Every step the princess took... Stained the ground, leaving uh, inerasable footprints. Anything she touched turned pitch black as if it was never white before. In order to protect the city, at the cost of many, many lives, the citizens caught the ink princess and had her thrown in a paper white prison. It seems unfinished. They're always watching. Yeah, I'm aware. Uh, I think I could... Oh. No, I wanted to... Tales of the Ink Princess, part 2. Oh, I'm reading it backwards. Fantastic. The princess passed through the fields, admiring how fruitful they were, and the crops were soaked in ink. The princess swam in the sea, admiring how vast and clear it was. And all the fish died from pollution. Please leave these lands. Can't you see everything is dying? The peasants begged the princess. But the ink princess was deaf, in, uh, was deaf to their prayers. As her heart had been soaked in ink a long, long time ago. No matter where the ink princess went. She was always unwelcome. There's a notebook that looks out of place. Read it. Tell of the ink princess. Once upon a time in a far, far uh, away land filled with ink. Lived an ink princess. Every morning she put on a pitch black ink dress and combed her hair uh, and combed her black hair. I cannot read. After spending thousands of years dwelling in the vast ocean filled with nothing but ink, the princess decided to end her solitude. Thus, the ink princess set out on a journey. I probably should have read it in order. Question one, two plus one. Yes. So it's the same answer. So. Ask your question. This is the first time I've had to solve puzzles in order to open the door. Ridiculous. 
Don't worry, I think I know the answer. Okay, it's the same, thank god. Wait, no, I wanted to take it, you stupid motherfucker. I mean, not like it matters, because... All of them. All of them shall be taken. No one shall be left in this room. Not a single one. Not a single one shall be left. I don't care if they're all empty. Oh, whoops. Well. Oh. Wait a goddamn second. This was surprisingly heavy. Lift it. Let's lift it instead. Find door knob. Oh, duct tape. So there are stuff in some boxes. The box is empty. I remember there was a black hole there in the other channel. It fits. Open the door? Yes. I think this is the same. Pretty sure. Password re required for exit. I'll enter it. No, don't touch it. Why are you acting so cautious all of a sudden? We've been here once. I switched the channel and... Switch the channel? What does that even mean? I don't think I quite understand myself. After doing that, I came back to the exact same place, but something that had changed. Like what? Like... You're still alive. Did I die right here? Your head got cut off. Oh. Then what should we do? I'll go first. Seth can rewind if I die before my expiration date. Besides, I can't afford losing you again. That's just stupid. And it's the only way out. Enter the password? Yes. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm just gonna look back. I'm just gonna, like, look back what the answer was, I... I don't really feel like, uh... Like... Going through all of that again. Um... Sh shut up. Ooh, Raid Raptor's got new support. Uh, anyway... Okay, uh, what is the, wait, uh, wait, so it's three, one, two, two, one, three, one, two, wrong password, don't tell me it's, you're telling me that the fucking order is different? Oh my god, okay, sure. Fuck you two. Um... Alright, so... Oh yeah, this is different. Oh, wow, that's amazing. Okay. So, I think it... It starts from the, the bottom right this time. Okay, so, it's like this. Uh, then take a picture of this. And then take a picture of this. Cool. So the password is... We'll find out. So it's... Uh... So, one, three... Uh, left up two two. This is still correct. Left up uh three one two one. Have a nice day. Oh. To the TV? Yes.
Cool. That doesn't work. Oh, wait. There's a channel here that seems to work. This channel doesn't work. Can I turn back? No turning back. You got thingy thing now, so why not? Go in? Sure. It's my only option. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Space of happiness. I don't like happiness. Space of abundance. The door won't open. Stick a needle in the eye. This door is glaring at me. Space of gore. Ooh, my favorite. Eh, it's not even that bad. Um, you wanna like have a? Come on, come on, open, open your fat little ass. Okay, only some of them can. I don't trust you. Go away. The flower lady ignored us. I mean, I did kill some of these guys. Well, I don't know if killed is the right word, but... Okay. And what's this? No way out. Space of happiness, I might as well. Wow, this is happy. Oh my god, look at this. Look how happy they are. Oh, and I died. Okay, sure, let's enter this. Wait. Oh, I can just... Oh, hi. My biggest fears are meat and pomegranates. Meat is red, violets are blue. Flowers that tell lies have a bad memory. Tell me something I don't know. Would you be so kind as to bring me the contents of the black box? Would you be so kind to bring me the contents of the... Oh wait, they, they all say... Would you be so kind as to give me... The contents of the, of the yellow box. Wait, huh? Blue box. Wait, 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 hold on. Black box. What? Um. Blue box. Green box. Uh huh? What? Um. This is hurting my eyes. Um, can you move? You move out of the fucking way, you fat piece of shit. Okay. Um. Well, this is different. Actually, yeah, this is different. All right, so I need the blue box. Bad end, lying flowers. Gotcha. All right. Okay, so there's some meat. Um, green box. 
Because always trust the green. Um, I stand by that statement. I can't rewind. Um, on, go out and save. Uh, red. Fancy brooch. I swear I've heard this from somewhere. I, I've heard the that theme from somewhere. Oh, look how happy everyone is. Isn't happiness just such a beautiful thing? Uh, so who wants the contents of the red box? No, you can fuck yourself. I hand the item to the flower lady. Why, thank you. Here, you can have my old-fashioned brooch. I don't need it anymore. I attach the brooch to my ribbon. It emits a faint light. We can use the pin attached to it. What is this noise? It's like a very uncomfortable ASMR. Stick a needle in the eye. So, we have a needle now. Crush your heart and hope to die. Stick a needle in the eye. Eye bleeds. Okay. Caution, beware of the three eyed. Or what? Instruction Put a friend unit, uh, one pieces in the, in the incinerator, in the incinerator, and push the on button. Go in yourself. Just kidding. Yet another cliche. I thought there would be volunteers. God damn. To pass forth, dispose of your friend unit. One piece. The store doesn't open. God damn it. I was hoping to go in. You are the three-eyed. Use the pin? Sure. Charlotte gouges the door's eye out. Door open. I... Oh my god, this is... Actually kinda hard to look at, like... This becomes difficult to see. Seems like the passage opens when something heavy is standing on the block. So you're saying that one of us has to stay here? And the other will search for another way out? That's right. Um... Choose who stays. Uh, Felix. You stay here and wait. I'll find a way. Are you sure you will be fine on your own? Well, I'm never on my own. I don't quite get it. Just be careful. <sighs> Take this just in case. Will do. Medical scissors from Felix. Son of a bitch. Can I talk to the clock? No. Wait, actually, what if I... Put Felix. Just kidding. You're not cliche. You dumbass fuck. Alright. Um, Jusu stays. Charlotte stays. I'll wait here. Maybe I'll find a way out. You're not going alone, of course. My puppeteer will go, uh, will go with you to ensure your well being, right? Excuse me, what? Hush, just believe me, okay? I'll be fine. I cannot leave my duty. 
Felix needs you more than I do. Please, just this once. I can't, Mr. Raisin de Tre. Mr. Raisin de Tre is is to watch over you. I believe you. I'm sorry. Uh, I thought real friends help each other in need. I'm a puppeteer, not a friend. God damn. Yeah, right. I'm sorry for thinking that way. I go by myself then. You see here, Felix. You're quick to change your mind, huh? It's too dangerous for you to go alone. Same goes for you. Wrong. For me, it's different. I can get killed, crushed. Wait, I can get killed, crushed, gutted, burnt, squeezed, and be revived again and again. Once you die, nothing can be done. I am afraid I do not quite follow. Just be careful. Take this just in case. Will do. See you later. Wait. Huh. Stupid fuck! Days. Excuse me, what? You know how... Do you know it's ridiculous? I do. You're my friend, so I believe in you. Uh... They... You, they'll come back and rescue me when I need you the most. I believe you. You're the best. I'm going to get fired, sad emoji. <laughs> Who are you talking to? My puppeteer, of course. Once again, I... Don't think I quite follow. Don't worry, it's a friend. Alright, I'll be back soon. Just be careful. Take this just in case. Will do. I'll be waiting. Okay, so now we control Felix. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. No. Get the fuck out of my face. Go. Get out of here. Never mind. This hurts to look at, by the way. Like, this is actually hurting my eyes. I... I was not sure where it was going. Um... Okay, um... You shouldn't get separated. We can look for another way out. Uh, can we? I don't think we can. Uh, um, I don't think there is. Door is closed shut. That's a door? You know, someone still has to, uh, still has to go look what's ahead. All right, Felix, say. Um. Can you get the fuck out of the way? Can you get the fuck out of the way? Nope. Oh. Oh. Um...
is the I think it's supposed to be like a path or something. It's a tic-tac-toe game. Yep, and I, I, I am seeing how... Hold on, so if I do... Yeah, okay, yep. Yeah. I, I, I... Okay, I see exactly what it is. Um, But, wait... Oh, never mind. All right. Huh. So the O is like a path. Yeah. So, yeah, like this. Huh. Oh god, is this gonna turn to Yume Niki now? Oh. Ooh, I'm trapped, aren't I? Okay, never mind. Oh, nope. I guess it's this turning into Yume Niki. I feel like I'm wasting time here. I wonder if Felix is alright. You left him all alone. The one he's alright? I hope so. Let's go back. You're cheering me up again, huh? I know this isn't part of your job, but you do this nevertheless. Thank you, Seth. It's my pleasure. Uh oh yeah, we can't go back. Alright, let's just go back. Right, that was wrong. Um I feel like there has to be a secret somewhere here. All right, so there we go. This isn't here. Oh my god, this is hurting my eyes. Like, everything is just monochrome. Oh, hi. The door is half open. Is it? Open the door? Door. Oh, well, hi. Little Peter Rabbit had a fly upon his nose. Little Peter Rabbit has a fly upon his nose. I've always wondered what rabbits have inside their bellies. I am this surprised. It wasn't cotton. I was too late. A girl approaches me, leaving the boy like, uh, like a toy she lost interest in. Why, hello, dear guest. The girl touches my cheek with her blood-soaked hand. Why are you so sad? Does it hurt anywhere? Come here. I'll sing you a Get Better song. Pain, pain, go away. Don't come back the other day. Run. What about Felix? We must do without him. Over my dead body. 
So I'm proud of it. He's not even... He's not even a person. What are you saying? Ah, oh, I get it. You just have to switch the channel to make everything better. To, to, to make everything, right? Hey, who are you talking to? There's no one but me. The very next moment, the girl looks at me as if she's seeing me for the first time. Let's play hide and seek. I'll close my eyes and count to 60. Make sure you find a good place to hide, or else you're it. Two, one. Oh shit, wait. Oh fuck. Dumbass. Um, she won't find me here, right? There's no place to hide. Where are you? I want to be guided alive. Please kill me before she does, Seth. I'm begging you. You got him? Have you? Are you? Are you out of your mind? Can't you see it? It's a bad end for me. Unless you rewind time, I'm dead one way or another. I still have the scissors. Felix, Felix gave me. You know what to do, right? Found you. Tea room. Umbrella man's afternoon tea time. The meat is not yet rotten, but the body is hollow. Yet another unsightly death. This is no good. Not only you've led the girl to a wrong path, You've completely lost control of her actions and she's ma and been manipulated by her. I cannot congratulate you on such an embarrassment of an ending. I am deeply sorry for my inappropriate behavior as a puppeteer. I hereby request you grant me another chance. That's quite the bold request, dear boy. I'll grant it, however, death can be rather amusing. Try as many times as you'd like. Uh... No way, I did not mean to quit the whole game. Fuck. I was to return to the title screen, but eh, it's fine. Uh, alright, load this. Please tell me that I'm stupid. That's, that's what you're telling me. It's that I'm fucking retarded. Uh, I want to see what happens if you cut her throat. With the scissors. Can you move out of the way? Can I go here? No. Move. Can you move? <laughs> All right. You fucking cunt. Um. Six isn't here, that's what it fucking was. Alright. Alright, open this. Is there actually a place to hide? Oh no, there isn't. Yeah, 
Yeah, no, I've tried every door. There's no place to hide. Where are you? Alright, alright. Um. Kill yourself. No, I want to. Where's the scissors? Wait. Oh, there they are. Charlotte uses the scissors on herself. Stop, stop, stop. Stop, stop, stop. Stop, stop, stop. Stop, stop, stop. Umbrella Man's afternoon tea time. The meat is not yet rotten, but the body is hollow. Yet another unsightly death. This is no good. Not only have you led the girl to a wrong path, you completely lost control of her actions and been manipulated by her. I cannot congratulate you on such an embarrassment of an ending. I am deeply sorry for my inappropriate behavior as a puppeteer. Here by request you grant me another chance. That is quite a bold request, dear boy. I'll grant it. However, death can be rather amusing. Try as many times as you'd like. Alright. Okay, so... This time, I'm going to... Use... Huh? Okay, there we go. There we go. So the same? Yep. It's a tic-tac-toe game. What's wrong? Wait a moment. I'll check on Charlotte. Alright. Hello there. Isn't it dangerous for a little girl to wander around here all alone? I'm waiting for my friends to come back to my side. Is that so? Well, it's a pity that they won't make it back before you meet your death in 10 minutes. That'd be mad. Seth will get fired if I die without him by my side. Is that all there is to it? I don't want to cause any I don't want to cause anyone trouble. Well, well, aren't you a nice child? But Felix, will he be okay? I'm afraid he'll die shortly after. There's one way to save your friend, however. Massman whispered something to Charlotte. Is that okay? Got it. Even though you disagree with my method? It's the only way to save him, right? I'm too weak to do anything alone. The man pets Charlotte's head. Don't blame yourself for a single thing, child. Well then. I'm only missing time. Guide me back, please. Sure, just a moment. Ah, the human body is such a fragile thing. I can't just apologize if I accidentally break it, can I? Well then, what do we have here? Hmm, all this junk is no good. Scissors? Not bad. But not the best option either. Such a shame. I get this pretty dress dirty. Hi, do you want to play hide and seek with me and my friends? You see, I'm really bored. That's right, let's play a game. Boredom's the worst, isn't it? <laughs> Open your eyes, here comes the scissors. Oh. Who is this person? What was I? 
I just have to switch the channel to make everything all right. Right? Hey. Don't make me a murderer. Huh? I forgot. Fuck. I just realized, right? What if... Oh, guy, I almost fucked it up again. What if I go back? Before going into that room. Or, like, I leave the room immediately. Something like that. Get out of the way. Get out of the fucking way! Stupid motherfucker. Get the fuck out of the way. No, here. Yes, I thought so. Charlotte isn't here. Charlotte? Felix, Seth, you're here. Good thing you're safe and sound. Are you hurt anywhere? And what in the world are you stuffing into the incinerator? Ah, uh, the blood isn't mine. While you were away, I... Figured I'd stuff the meat chunks we saw earlier in here. Is that so? Are you alright? Yeah, sorry for worrying you. Jeez, I was worried about you. But here you are, covered in blood and more obnoxiously cheerful than ever. Well, sorry about that. Wait. You were worried about me? That's something new. You make it sound like I'm a jerk, but you are. Well... Thank you for trusting me, Seth. You truly are, my friend. I'm a puppeteer, not my friend. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Then you're the best puppeteer ever. Let's go, everyone. Let's leave this room. Pass forth the pose of your friend. It's open. Charlotte? Hey, are you alright? You're spacing out. It's nothing. Liar. Fine, you don't have to tell me that. Uh, you don't have to tell me what happened. Here, take my hand. That takes Felix's hand. She's shaking. Let's go in. Right. Channel doesn't work. Hey, Felix. Yes? Can you tell me more about what we're looking for? I know... I know I'm not as smart as you, but I'll try to understand. Well... All I know is that the people here are called... Pythias. Who were created by an oracle whom they call their god, at least used to. The Pythias are extremely powerful. They can alter reality to their to their will, which most likely resulted in different dimensions being created. From what I've gathered, every species perceived them differently. Otherwise they wouldn't look so uh so human. Right to you. Last time I visited there was so much more of them, yet we barely met anyone on our way. 
This place is a mess. It wasn't supposed to be like this. Perhaps something bad happened. Contamination warning. Organic tissue ahead. Well, hello there. Great. A dead Pythia. Poor thing. Another dead body. It's not moving. They all look the same. We probably look the same to them as well, you know? There are so many of them. It's not moving. Slaughterhouse 2. Slaughterhouse 1. Let's go into Slaughterhouse 1. Ooh, enjoy the vacation with style. Bowsaw. It's always here when you need it the most. Comes with two blades. Cool. We're not taking that. Weapon will come in handy though. Now you don't know how to use it, kids, these days. I can almost hear you sighing from the other side of the control console. Are they all ball saws? Yes, they are. Ways to find out if your neighbor is possessed by God. One, shoot him and see what happens. You know what? Yeah, you're not wrong. Let's go into Slaughterhouse 2. She is us, we are her. There's only 16 files, not even 20. Why 16? Why 16? That's, so inc that's such an incomplete number. There's so many of them. Dead. Slaughterhouse 3. I wonder what happened here. The third. There's no one in these rooms. Only the corpses. Well, the corpse. Uh, another dead body. I mean, it is a slaughterhouse. So... A rotten corpse. I am so hungry right now. Maybe she's just sleeping. I don't think she is. Bad end executed. Wow. Uh, don't go into Slaughterhouse 4. Got it. Could have just told me that. Um... Slaughterhouse 5. The door won't open. Okay. It's not moving. Slaughterhouse 4 again? Oh, well this is different. You son of a bitch. Um... I feel like I know what the, what the code is, but it sucks. Oh! Oh, I know! 9, 1, 4. 8, 9, 1, 4. Because the last slaughterhouse before this was, uh, was, an, was the shape of an 8. 8, 9, 1, 4. Door remains closed? Oh. Wait, was it not an 8? Won't seem to open. Uh, it wasn't this. It was this. Right? Yeah, it's an 8. Unless it's supposed to be a 0. I am actually hungry as hell. Oh my god. I have not eaten in so long. Door remains closed. Is it maybe... This is zero. This is nine... One, four. No?
Uh, wait. Unless there's something... No, this, this is where it ends. They'll have the same faces. The fourth. Oh, uh, the second. The first. Oh. Okay, so four is the first number. The second is nine. I think the third was eight. And then this is the fourth. And it's one. Okay. So it's four, nine, eight, one. I believe. So, four, nine, eight, one. Yes, there we go. Uh, follower mask obtained. Executioner mask. Mask. Push the cute into execute. An absolute must have for all ladies and gentlemen. How do I look? Rather menacing. Can I have one too? You're not fun. Oh, <gasps> uh, and now we can go into. Imp Wait, what? Oh, it's just uh, it's just defaults to nine 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 nine. Maybe she's just sleeping. Hello. A rotting corpse. A rotting corpse. Cut the pain off with amputation saw. Made of the highest quality steel. Who said a girl a girl's best friend was diamonds? Yeah, you're not wrong. Dead. A rotting corpse. There's a stack of notes on the table. Okay, well, I'm gonna need to take a picture of this because no way I'm gonna remember it. Alright, and I know exactly where it goes to. Obtain the note. Oh, okay. I guess that they need to. Um, nah, it's fine. It's quicker if I just look at it. Uh, I could have taken a less blurry picture, but still. Alright, so. Eight. Three. Seven. Five. Two, nine. Um, Christmas morning. You'll be happier with a shotgun. Yep, I, I do like shotguns. Everyone is born to execute. Yeah. Television room. An all family adventure. God hunt. The door is locked. Of course it is. Buy our air-powered guns for an unforgettable fun experience. Wise man, wise man gun, barrels of fun. When you can't sleep, don't count sheep. Count your chainsaw. Oh, hi. So that's how they portray oracles here. She's beautiful. Just for your information, oracles do not have physical form nor a gender. The ones depicted here is no more than a young Pythian priestess. Fight for equality. That's the most normal thing I read all day. I think I heard something behind the door. Nope, it's not exec- I hope it's not executioners. Right now, we are the executioners, remember? Open the door. Oh. Maybe she's just sleeping. Another dead body. Maybe she's just sleeping. The dead body. One of the dismembered- One of the dismembered bodies is moving. She's still alive. Well, well, hello, dear. Hello, dear executioners. You're so tiny, yet you're the ones who came to the end of life on our last child. How ironic. 
come forth and swing your blade. Don't make us wait any longer. I'm, I'm very sorry, but we won't harm you in any way. You won't? How come? Well, for starters, we're not the ones of your kind. Take off your mask. The girl extends her weak hands to my face. Just two eyes. You're merely a traveler. Uh, am I missing something? Hush. We're speaking to a real oracle. The creator of all that exists in this universe. This body is just a dying vessel. It... It's an honor to meet you. You seem to be a good child. We believe we've known your parents once. C the girl coughs up blood. You should leave these lands. For we do not have much time left. What about this girl? She can no longer be saved. But we... We wish to be with our children until the very end. But there are only corpses. We should leave Charlotte. Right. Will we meet again? Sneaking you shall find. You might want to put your masks back on. What if I go this way? Become an executioner today. Oh, absolutely. Sign up for the God Hand by calling us. Feeling oppressed? Your life is a wreck. You did nothing wrong. Get your revenge by joining the God Hand today. I know I did nothing wrong. I'm basically like Watame. I never did. I never do anything wrong. What a denial, eh? Giri giri Watame. I can save. I probably should not have overwrote that save, but it's fine. So I have a feeling it'll be the last channel we visit. Well, it might be not far from the truth. Well then, let's go. I feel like I feel like I have to apologize for what? Many things: running away, putting you in danger, making you come here. I found what I was looking for, yet I have no. I feel no satisfaction at all. I didn't have the slightest idea of what happened in this place. I still don't. I thought Uncle would recognize my achievements if I wrote a paper on the oracles. A phenomenal entity. Yet this oracle and their universe reek of death. I was 20 billion years too late. You must be thinking how meaningless this journey was. Feel free to laugh at me. Scold him. Charlotte pinches Felix's cheeks. You're thinking too much, you dummy. Isn't everything in our life pretty much meaningless? We're so tiny, aren't we? Like worms or maggots, even. Yet, yeah, we consider ourselves important and do everything to benefit ourselves. Isn't that what's laughable? Besides, I like going on, ad on adventures with you. For me, it's like being with a, with a friend. What's up with that pseudo-intellectual monologue? Don't try to seem smarter than you are, human maggot. Aren't we already friends? If... if you say so. Um, what are we waiting for? Let's go in. Oh, look at that. Applause, applause. Welcome. Welcome, dear guests. We are waiting for you. Now we can finally have a talk. Well then, did you enjoy the show? Was it... not to your liking? The show? Well, of course. All of the worlds you've visited. There used to be an infinite number of channels, you know? Now they've turned into mere recordings of their past glory. If I may ask, what happened to this world? Many, many things. A long time ago, we used to be called a god, although we never were one. Our own children raised a knife against us. We used to have thousands of hands, yet they've cut all of them off and now we are powerless. We used to observe the world with billions of eyes, yet they gouged out every single one and now we are blind. We used to walk in leaps and bounds. 
the, the worlds we created. Oh wait, through the worlds we created. Well, actually, they forgot they forgot the R, so I wasn't wrong. Yet we can no longer take a simple. We cannot take a single step, as our legs were taken away. The creation we dearly loved, regardless of their deeds, destroyed themselves, and now we are alone. Yet we forgave them for their sins, and we forgive you. You see, the universe we've created is dying. Nothing exists anymore. All we can do... All we can do is indulge in the memories of the past, no matter how distorted they are. Soon, we will fall apart. So will this land and those walk... Uh, so will this land and those walking on it. That would be troubling. We absolutely have to return home by tomorrow morning. Well, there is a way, human child. Do you wish to try? Agree. Input error. What do I have to do? Put your hands on the screen, would you? Are you sure about this? Well, there's no other way you can leave. Didn't you hear the oracle? You would not have listened to me either way, would you? Even though I don't want to cause trouble for anyone, in the end, I'm quite, I'm quite a troublesome person, aren't I? I put my hands on the screen. This is a trap. The Oracle. No. The god of this world puts their palms to match mine on the other side of the, of the screen. I can only vaguely remember what happened next. I accepted the god into my heart, and we walked home hand in hand. Everything that I was became her, and anything that she was became a part of me. Together we said goodnight to the dying world. All the life, the planets, the stars, the black holes, even the atoms have ceased to exist. One by one the, ch the channel switched off. Um, you uh, oh there we go. The Oracle used my body as a vessel, and used up all the remaining power she had to bring to bring us home. Thanks to that, we were able to make it back home safely. While we were away, not a second passed on, in our world. That's quite the story, my dear. To personally meet an Oracle, even a dying one, what a great luck you've run into. Well, who would have known? Do you always have to wear this creepy mask when you talk to me? Well, when you see me? I know you're using father's body as a container to talk to me anyway. Easy with the tongue, dear. I thought it would be inconsiderate of me to have a chat with you while I'm using someone you know as a vessel, but if you insist, the umbrella man takes off his mask. Better now? Yep, much better. Your, your eyes have such a pretty color. Say, umbrella man. Hmm? Do you happen to know the person I met in the TV world? Why are you so sure there was anyone there at all? Well, that's because... I committed an unimaginable sin, yet I only vaguely remember it. As if I watched it from the side. How naivety never ceases to amuse me. Of course, we had to edit your source code shortly after you came back. I can't tell her the truth, can I? You're talking as if we're in a video game. <laughs> Who's gonna tell her? Most of the world, most of the worlds are code-based, my dear, as you say. But why would you do that? Those memories were unnecessary. Remember, we do not want to fail your education program. It's already been messed up enough. With an oracle becoming a part of you. I am sure Mr. Seth will be greatly upset if you two go around causing havoc when he isn't looking. We both know I'm not like that, sir. Ahem. <clears throat> By the way, I am rather surprised that you were able to contain a godlike entity without all of your life supporting systems collapsing. Probably she was too weakened to do that much damage to my body. Mm hmm. 
What has become of them now? She's still sleeping. I wish we had talked more. Even after seeing her memories, I still don't know much about her. The oracles, what exactly are they really? One could compare them to stars, reaching the end of their lives. They gradually lose all their power and become infantile white dwarfs. Think of yourself. Think of yourself. A god capable of creating new life from zero care for such insignificant beings like you. Aren't you talking to me right now? Ahaha, <laughs> good one. Well, this isn't... Uh, well, isn't that great that you have a new friend? Now, take your pills and go to sleep. Wouldn't want to nod off in your lessons, although they only postpone your unemployment status. Thanks for finding an hour to spend with me. Good night, Mr. Umbrella Man. Good night, little Charlotte. Received pills. I'm off to sleep then. Sleep well. What? I can't... Uh, okay, sure. Gotta take the pills first. Took the pills. Hold the fuck up. Enough TV for this week. Nothing of interest inside. What? Ara? Why does everything have color now? I mean, it's more pleasing to the eyes, because god damn I cannot stand another like another hint of white. But God. This is just What happened here? Tableware inside. Flowers. Painting. It's worn by the fireplace. Painting. Flowers. Tableware inside. Dear Charlotte, I'll be home late. Call the yeah yeah. Mom brought some pomegranates and other fruit. Door leads to the basement. Door leads to the first floor that we've never seen actually. Too sleepy to wander around. Let's sleep, Seth. Wait, so I'm still like Seth is still there. Door is locked. Swim for everyone. Just make it made easy. Napkin, blah blah blah. Okay. Wait, the phone is in there. Hi there. Take the toy. I take the toy with me. Teddy bear. An empty basket. Hi, my cat. Meow. Now it's just a normal cat. Sleep? I wonder if I'll see space fish in my dreams. Good night, Charlotte. I hug my rabbit toy. Good night, Felix. Good night, Umbrella Man and Oracle. Was this all in her dream? Like, what, was this all in her imagination? Good night, Garden Angel who watches over me. Hello, Charlotte, Episode 1. Junk Food, Gods, and Teddy Bears. End. Thank you for playing. I hope you enjoyed playing this game as much as we enjoyed making it. See you next time, Episode 2. Was this all in her imagination? Um, I do want to check one thing, right? So, no, I don't think it was here. Uh, load 14. But what if I go back now? I made a mistake. Um, I haven't triggered the cutscene yet, right? In this save. No going back for now. Okay. Well, that's the answer. Alright. Um... Okay... So... Alright, the only other thing I need to check is... 
What happens if you refuse? Yeah, 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 yeah. I know, I know, I know. Shut up. I don't need, I don't need to. All right, cool. Applause, applause, applause. I'm in for the applause, applause, and for the applause, applause, and for the... Skip all this dialogue, please. I just need to get to the op. I made a mistake, huh? Honestly, judging by how that dialogue went, I'm pretty sure that no matter what, she will approach the... Like, she will accept to get close. Shut up. Okay, so I guess there's only really one ending. Are you fucking kidding? I'm... I fucked this up again. Oh my god, I'm clicking too fast. God damn it, man. <sighs> um... Black apps apologize. Hug him. It's okay, please stop blaming yourself. Isn't everything in my life pretty much meaningless? We're so tiny, aren't we? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, it's the same. Show. If we give them some good view. It's dying, nothing else exists anymore. Soon it'll fall apart. So I have to have to turn by tomorrow morning. Well, there's a way, human child. Do you want to try it? Refuse. Input error. What do I have to do? Put your hands on the screen, would you? Are you sure about this? Well, there's no other way you can leave. Can you hear the oracle? Yep, okay. So, the dialogue is the same regardless. I can only vaguely remember what happens next. Okay, yeah. It's all the same. Alright.